Hello, my name is Courtney Dabney, and I am a volunteer with Black Child Development, and this is my daughter, Reagan. Hi. Reagan is 12, and she came through the Freedom School program, and she and I both, and my husband, Marlon, all volunteer with Black Child Development because we believe in the mission and the vision and for what this organization stands for, and its commitment to children and families. So... Uh, without further ado, we are going to do story time today, um, and we are reading. Reagan, what are we reading? We are reading Fancy Nancy, The Dazzling Book Report. Okay. This is one of my favorite books. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Well, I used to read Fancy Nancy to Reagan uh, when she was much younger, and so, and then she began reading them herself, and so um, this is a special book for us. Monday is my favorite day. Why? Because Monday is library day. Before we leave, we select a book. Select is a fancy word for pick. It is like getting a present for the week. Bree selects a book on dinosaurs. Robert selects a book on funny poems. Teddy selects a scary story. I select a book about an Indian girl. She has a fancy name, Sacagawea. Can you say it like this? Saka Joea. Later, Miss Glass has thrilling news. Thrilling is even more exciting than exciting. We get to do a book report. Your first book report. How grown up, Mom says at dinner. Yes, I know. I say. My book is a biography. It is about a real person. After dinner, I read my book. Dad helps with the hard words. I learn all about Sacagawea. Sacagawea was a princess. She lived 200 years ago out west. She helped two explorers reach the Pacific Ocean. Mom takes me to the art store. I need stuff for the cover of my book report. I want it to be great. I am the second best artist in our class. This isn't bragging. You can ask anybody. I get a bag of little beads, some yarn, and markers. I start working on the cover. I work on it every night. I make Sacagawea look very brave because she was. She found food for the explorers. She kept them safe from enemies. Just remember to leave time for the words, Mom keeps saying. I will, I will, I tell her. Miss Glass wants you to write about the book. That's Dad says over and over. That's what a book report is. I know that, I tell him. Writing words will be easy. Ta-da! The cover is finished. Sacagawea has yarn braids, beads, and fringe are glued on her clothes. I must admit, it is dazzling. That is fancy for eye-popping. Now, I will write my report. I get out the lined paper and a pen with a plume. That's a fancy word for feather. The trouble is, I am tired. I know all about Sacagawea, but the right words won't come. What am I going to do? I have to hand in my book, I have to hand in my report tomorrow. I am desperate, I tell mom. That means I am in trouble. Mom lets me stay up longer. Still, my report ends up only two sentences. The next day, Everyone sees my cover and says, wow. But hearing other reports makes me nervous. All of them are longer than mine. All of them are more interesting. I read my report. Sacagawea was a heroine. She helped people in trouble. Everyone wait, everybody waits to hear more, but there is no more. I am crestfallen. That is fancy for sad and ashamed. I spent too much time on the cover, I tell Miss Glass. Miss Glass understands. Why don't you tell the class about your book? So I do. I tell them all about the brave things Sacagawea did. Sacagawea was a heroine. Miss Glass is a heroine too. At least she is to me. Thank you so much. We enjoyed reading with you today. Bye. Bye.